Hi guys, my name is John. Welcome to Daily Theology. If this is your first time here, I post short daily videos about theology and current events to help equip you to share hope. So please subscribe below and hit the bell notification thing so you don't miss future videos. Keith Rollins is an unlikely hero, but this story will warm your heart. Here's a quote from Christian.com about the story. The postal worker who found a toddler walking barefoot along a Maryland highway has given God the credit for the incredible rescue. Ethan Adeyemi, age two, was spotted by Keith Rollins after being missing for 10 hours. Apparently, the search involved neighbors, canine units, helicopters, drones, firefighters, and police officers, and they had all joined in in the hunt for this toddler after his family had reported him missing. He disappeared from outside his home around 10.20 p.m. on Wednesday night, but it wasn't until around 8 a.m. the following morning that Rollins, a worker for the U.S. Postal Service, saw the toddler as he was driving down the highway. Speaking to local media, Rollins said this, It was remarkable that he found the boy when he did, as he was shivering cold, according to the report. The toddler was treated for hypothermia and is in good condition. Rollins said this, It was God ordained that I be in that place at that time. What an amazing testament to God's grace and goodness. It's far too easy to overlook God's kindness towards us in everyday life. The Bible says this, the heart of man plans his way, but the Lord establishes his steps. Proverbs 16, verse 9. God is sovereign, and as believers, we should rejoice in the big and small things of life each day. Praise the Lord for Keith and God being glorified through this story. Spiritually speaking, everyone is born spiritually lost. This is why sharing the gospel with our friends, neighbors, and family is so important. Unless you're born again, you will not see the kingdom of God. Don't forget to hammer that like button like the 95 Theses, and I will see you tomorrow. Soli Deo Gloria. God bless.